So hello and welcome to today's quick news video. So if you've been following the Rockstar community news lately, you'll know that Take-Two Interactive have been stroking down a lot of Grand Theft Auto mods for GTA 3, Vice City, San Andreas 4 and 5. And pretty much all the mods that were DMCA'd were mostly map ports for the GTA maps, like GTA Underground, Liberty City and Vice City stories for PC and so on. And I didn't really report on it because, you know, it's GTA news, not really bully. But, today, on August 10th, Take-Two Interactive have started issuing DMCA claims against some bully mods for Grand Theft Auto, such as Open Ball, which, coincidentally, was the last video I published on this channel. Interesting, I think. Alongside the 5M map Grand Theft Auto 5 Bullworth, which, like Open Ball, only bought the map to Grand Theft Auto 5, they have also struck down Open Manhunt, a mod that lets you explore manhunt levels in GTA San Andreas. This, combined with Take-Two's comments of working on free remasters of their own in school, has got people wondering if there is a remake of the Grand Theft Auto trilogy coming, because Take-Two Interactive confirmed that themselves, and the fact they are now going after Bully and Manhunt feed mods have got some people wondering if this is a hint that they're going to do something with Bully and Manhunt coming soon, or if it's just Take-Two being a prick against all their IPs. Personally, I think it's that, but I think it's interesting why they're going after Bully and Manhunt stuff as well, because Manhunt hasn't had anything done to it since about 2007, you know, without Manhunt 2. There is technically that Camheads game in Grand Theft Auto Online, which was a Manhunt arcade initially, and Bully hasn't had anything done to it since Anniversary Edition nearly five years ago now. So I think it's interesting why they're seemingly going after Bully and Manhunt stuff as well. Could this be a hint that they've got plans for the franchises, or, as I said, just being a prick? Another thing is, at the Take-Two Interactive Investors Call, Take-Two were actually asked about this by an investor and they said they were issuing DMCA claims against mods that threaten their economy, which I personally think is utter bullshit because nobody's going to avoid buying Bully or Manhunt or even Grand Theft Auto 3 because they can just download a map for it in San Andreas. But today's video is just a bit of a warning to any Rockstar game modders. It doesn't matter if you're a GTA modder or a Bully modder, just be careful with whatever you're making. It seems like Take-Two are going down the warpath and striking down most mods that have something from another game that there's bought into this one. Keep an eye out if any Bioshock or Mafia mods get taken down for like San Andreas or GTA 5 as well. And I also want to say that keep an eye out for the next video that will be published on this channel. I think it's going to be one that will be very interesting for many people. But thank you for watching today's news video and have a great day. Unless you take to Interactive, in that case you can go fu-